Welcome to this short glimpse at the flow modeling capabilities in sim for life My name is Erdem and we will guide you through a quick demo of simulating the flow inside our bifurcation based on an MRI dataset. We are going to explore the intuitive GUI and the interactive tools which speed up your work. sim for life can embed medical image data such as DICOMs in the visualization tool. These images can be directly segmented using the ISEC segmentation environment, which is live linked to sim for life ISEC offers a large variety of methods to segment medical images. The segmented datasets are instantly available in sim for life With just a few clicks, sim for life can construct a 3D geometry based on the supplied segmentation dataset. sim for life offers many interactive tools to manipulate, extend and repair your model. The user can quickly define surface patches used for the later specification of boundary conditions. The platform offers a variety of physics and numerical solvers which can be added to a project. For this purpose we choose to set up a flow simulation. sim for life employs interactive methods wherever possible, simply using drag and drop for example linking the model to the simulation and automatically assigning all relevant parameters to the simulation. The same concept is used for boundary condition assignment. The simulation is set up using a comprehensive workflow and is ready in a matter of minutes. The computed results are based on geometry which was extracted from imaging data just a moment ago. The results can be presented in a number of different ways to stress the important aspects of the data in an ideal way. Of course, more complex vessel structures featuring for example an aneurysm are equally simple to model, simulate and visualize. Fine structures like stents can be properly accommodated into the simulation. In the human body, flow is of course not restricted to the vascular system. Another example is the circulation of cerebrospinal fluid in the brain ventricles. Multiple viewers can be combined in one visualization to offer the spectator a complete and comprehensive set of information. Other flowing media like air in the bronchial tree can be addressed in an equally intuitive fashion. This shows how flow in highly complex and physiologically realistic structures can be treated using sim for life. 